So hey guys, this is Karan here. Welcome to Tech Karan YouTube channel. I am back with the new video. In this video, we are gonna take a look at the latest update of MIUI 11 Pro Room, which is available for our Redmi Note 8 and I have installed on my Redmi Note 8. If you don't know what is MIUI 11 Pro Room and what actually this room have, you can simply search on google and you will see a lot of positive responses against this room this room is one of the best ever modded MIUI 11 room which has a lot of customization options so what are you waiting for let's get quickly straight to the video So as you can see I have installed this room on my Redmi Note 8. This is the theme, this is not the actual look, this is the theme I have installed on my uh, room. Unique V11 is the theme, uh, Unique V11 is the name of the theme. What are the features of this theme? I have already made a video on this, ve on this theme also. You can go and check it out and this video is already available on my second channel which is uh, Tekkar and Hindi which is with name Tekkar and Hindi and I made a lot of Hindi videos there you can go and subscribe to me don't forget to subscribe me so let's take a look at this this room features this room comes with the MIUI 11 Pro 20.3.26 beta version which is the last and latest update of MIUI 11 base rooms for Redmi Note 8 you had the security patch of 1st of March 2020 which is the latest ever security patch and this is the this is still based on Android 9 so no Android 10 yet and I think our device will get Android 10 with the MIUI 12 which is releasing very soon so let's hope for it and fingers crossed let's take a look at some other things by default you get some a lot of customization options I will not show you that I will not showing you that you have to customize your device by using third-party apps you will get lots of customization here first of all let's take a look at the animations you can see animations are perfect without any issues at all without any lag apps are almost same like official MIUI 11 room and uh, what are the things you get you get by default camera of 48 megapixel which is perfectly working this is not a ANX camera you get this zoom camera here which is working this one is the wide angle ultra wide angle which is also working perfectly so without any issues you can use your stock camera here that's a good thing also alongside with that you can use Google camera I'm using Google camera 7.2 in this room so if you want to use any other Google camera build like 7.3 or 7.0 7.1 whichever you like you can use and try out this camera will work definitely on your MIUI 11 working device other things like what is the Geekbench score let me check out and let me show you the Geekbench score which you get in this custom room is very very good I think it's again gone wait 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 this time now it will op uh, it will properly work for you whenever you open geekbench score you get the single core of 314 score and multi core 1376 that's a very very good geekbench score of this device you get a lot of better geekbench scores for in other customers also but if you are talking about miui 11 base room then this is the very good geekbench score okay now let's take a look at some other things all apps are same you get a proper new look by using this theme so this is another good thing let's take a look at some features of this room in sim cards and mobile networks you have the feature to time to select sim card that's a good thing you have other option like remember sim preferences but i have only single sim so i cannot show you in Wi-Fi settings you have you don't have any extra things but in connection sharing you have the option of me share you have the option of data usage other things like smart mobile network if you're using dual sim device then it's a very good feature for you and these are the extra things you get here other things like multiple users this option is not available by default you have to enable it from developer options always on display is not working at any case i have tried a lot of times but always on display is not working so that's not a good thing that's not a main thing you can check out other things like fingerprint scanner action is available if you want to use this option you can try out i don't know it's working or not i have no balance on my sim actually 
manual time adjustment until the screen dims you can choose this feature it's a very good working feature lock screen owner info set lock screen shortcuts and other things at all other things in display you have the option to choose disable font me length so you can you can notice that these fonts are from chinese me pro me by room so these fonts look nice but if you want to disable these fonts you can simply disable from here animations are available whichever animation you like you can choose that one that looks nice i think this is the screen of animation this one is nice working perfectly like decrease this one is the animation of screen of animation i think yep this time you can see you can notice something animation duration scale like this one this one is slowly it's very slowly also you can choose whichever you like list animation is available these are the options you can choose like this one which has a lot of things to customize so you can play with your device like a pro screen modes are available full screen mode notch and status bar as you can see i have used the hide notch option and it is working in my case you can see easily hide and move status bar icons and status bar you have the option to hide or enable some icons on status bar if you don't want to choose to show these icons you can hide from here and another lot of settings if i show you all the settings there the video would be so long so i cannot show you all the settings there are a lot of settings which you can choose animations are working perfectly some other settings are there so this was mi 11 pro the latest build if you want to choose it if you want to use it on your device you can use this on your device at now one thing if you want to know how to install this rom i have already made a dedicated video on this so you can simply search on youtube how to install MIUI 11 Pro Room in Redmi Note 8. Okay, you just have to simply search this one, and you will see first video would be mine. How to install MIUI 11 Pro in Redmi Note 8? The video would be of 15 minutes, so you have to watch this video full to understand everything regarding that. How to install this ROM on your device? I'm not gonna show you because the process is really, really complicated to install this ROM. But still, this ROM is worth it. Some bugs are fixed, like the previous ROM had some bugs, like Play Store download was stuck at 99. But if you want to use this time, you can simply go to install, and your download will not be stuck at 99. You can see. Wait, let me show you by downloading. it is properly downloading it will not be stuck at 99 it will be installed properly as you can see it is installing so it uh, this bug is solved this is a very good thing some bugs were there those were also fixed so this is properly good looking room you can install and try out on your device so this was all from today's video i hope you like it thanks for watching goodbye see you in the next video soon